into record a letter that the board received this past Tuesday from the citizens against uh, phosphate mining. Dear Bradford County Commissioner, you should all have this, um, by the way. My name is Heidi Mahaffey Esquire, and our long law firm, Robert N. Hatzel, PA, represents Citizens Against Phosphate Mining. The commission has an upcoming meeting today, October 17th, and it must be brought to your attention that agenda item SU 1902 has been deficiently noticed and therefore must be tabled until proper notice in compliance with Bradford County's land development regulations has been issued to ensure the public has been fully informed and can participate in the hearing. Florida jurisprudence has long recognized the importance of municipalities and counties providing sufficient and clear notice to inform the public of the essence and scope of the proposed use within the confines of, the jur of its jurisdiction. Accordingly, any improperly noticed special use will be declared null and void should the notice be deficient. Section 13.4 Bradford County's Land Development Regulations governs notices of hearings and mandates in subsection two that a special permit requiring a public hearing before the Board of County Commissioners shall be noticed once in a newspaper of general circulation in the area with the publication not less than 10 days prior to the hearing. Furthermore, section 13.4 provides five unambiguous and specific qualifications of the notice in order for the county to be in compliance and for proper notice to be issued. The notices required by this section shall A, state the date, time, and place of the public hearing, B, responsibly identify the property that is the subject of the application or appeal, C, give a brief description of the action requested or proposed, D, state the place where a copy of the proposed action may be inspected by the public, and E, advise that interested parties may appear at the public hearings and be heard regarding the proposed action. As demonstrated below, on or about October 3rd, under the section legals in the local paper, deficient notice was published regarding SU 19-02 special use permit application for mining, submitted by Comores Company. You can see the attached um, publications that you have. As the notice was not in compliance with section 13.4, the hearing on this matter must be tabled until proper notice is issued. Firstly, in violation of section B above, the notice fails to give a brief description of the action requested or proposed. The reference to the application as a special permit for mining fails to provide any description of the type of mining proposed, the extent of mining, the extent of mining proposed, nor the proposed size of the mining operation. The failure to provide a brief description does not adequately put the public on notice of the potential impact to the community for there to be any meaningful input at a public hearing on this matter. Further, I'd just like to say that um, we all know about all the lawsuits, you know, that uh, related to Chamores, and you want to hear from all the experts. We've heard from their experts. We need a chance to hear from other experts that are not affiliated with them. Thank you.